Hello, and welcome. I am Dr. Pauline Fu. In this video, I will demonstrate how to create a light tab course on the blackboard. So first, you log on the blackboard. and pick the course. Uh, after that, I'm going to delete something here. So I want to start from the scratch. Okay, you go to the plus side and click content area and you type in a name, for example, weekly learning. And I just want to move this a little bit above. And then you double click this weekly learning. Go to partner content. Oops. And then select content market. After that, you pick Sengage Might Link courses. And add homework planned for. And then you select digital call for my tab new perspectives collections. Link to the course and create a new course. Uh, course name. So this is a computer course, Compton 10 4. 2021 start date September the 7th and end date end date maybe August 31st 2025, okay. continue, and accept the default settings for the activity score, continue. So your import is complete, okay and click submit. So you have this course created on the Blackboard. So let's give it a test. So double click this one, launch course content. Uh, you can skip this one. So you have all the modules. Okay. So this is the, the textbook we are going to use for business computer applications one. Just close it. Skip this one. All right, so you have Word, Excel. Just double check Excel have Okay, total eight modules, okay. And if you want to create a weekly link, you can close this one, go back here and build content, module page or content folder. So this is week one. Okay. And we are going to study what module one has shown here. Let's double check something here. So 
So in week module one, we are going to learn word module one. Week two, word module two. Okay, week three, module one, module two, etc. Okay, so I'm going to just go back to the blackboard here. So week one, word module one. Click submit. And then double click week one. And then partner content. Go to this one. Oops. Select content. So now you can select what module one. Click down pointing A. So what module one, but under what module one, I only want to see the textbook descriptions. Uh, training, project A, some exam. Okay, continue. Okay, import complete. Then click submit. So I created work a uh, week one module. Okay, and this one I it is a redundancy. So I'm going to delete this one because okay. So you repeat this pattern to create modules for other weeks. So I'm going to do one more example. Go to weekly learning. I already created week one. Now I create week two. And for week two, we are going to study word module two. So double click week two. Okay. Content market and pick this course. Then select content. So week two is still about word document, not word module. It is about module two. So in this module two, I'm going to select the textbook and then some exam, some training, and project A. Continue. Submit. Okay, so I have week two content. So if I go back to the weekly learning, I have the course here. I have week one, week two. You can continue to do week three until week 15. That's it. Thanks for watching.